we're just seeing a lot of rain right now, though we did mention, KMAC, that you can't rule out the possibility of a storm. Right now, we're just kind of getting a soaking. Yeah, that's right. We are certainly looking at another wet day out there, another gray day. That's what we're seeing here from our Victory Field camera of downtown Indianapolis, and that's how it's going to remain for the remainder of the afternoon into the evening. Now, it's not looking to be a complete soaker. We won't have continuous steady rain over these next several hours moving into the evening, but it's going to stay damp and it's going to be scattered light showers around. We had a few thunderstorms this morning. Those have moved off to the east, and this is what we're seeing on Live Guardian radar at this time just some hit and miss light showers stretching very close to the I-70 corridor. This will continue to push off to the east and then more showers behind it. Can't rule out an isolated thunderstorm as we head into the afternoon and evening, but looking for that to be below severe criteria. We'll time it out for you here in CBS 4 Future View, and I do want to emphasize again, there will be gaps of dry time. That's what we're seeing much of right now, and we'll continue to see that as we head into the afternoon. So even by 3 o'clock, looking at hit and miss showers, Hours scattered about the area will be off and on through the evening. This will take us through the evening commute at 6 30 p.m. and then continue on as we head into early tomorrow morning. Temperatures at this time have cooled from those mid 60s this morning. We're now down to 58 degrees in Indianapolis with those cooler winds out of the north right around 12 uh, miles per hour. We're at 58 in Kokomo, 64 in Bloomington. And as we head through the rest of the afternoon, temperatures will stay rather steady in those upper 50s, lower 60s. And for the evening, we'll keep those chances for some showers around. So it's going to remain damp for this evening as well. Have the rain jacket handy if you're going to be out taking the dog for a walk. We'll have temperatures by 10 o'clock into those low and mid 50s. And here we are in CBS 4 Future View taking us through the rest of the evening. So by 10 o'clock, still looking at some wide scattered showers around a little bit of a lull in activity as we get through the late night hours then right around 2 33 a.m. This will be the last of the rain that we'll be seeing at least for a little bit before we start to bring back some sunshine, move those clouds on out, looking for possibly a little bit of a damp pavement early tomorrow morning, but those showers should be on out of here before sunrise. We have those cooler northerly winds that are streaming in after that front has passed off now to our south, and we're going to see temperatures continuing to fall into those mid 40s as we head into early tomorrow morning. So temperatures tomorrow will be much cooler than what we saw early this morning, about 15 to 20 degrees cooler cooler from this morning. Tomorrow afternoon we'll have that sunshine around, but those highs only reach those lower 60s and we'll keep that cooler pattern with temperatures in those low 60s for the rest of the week. This afternoon will be up to 50s, while plenty of dry time in between pockets of rain for the rest of the week into the weekend. All right, K Mac, thank you.